Meanwhile, Republican challenger Tony Weed is watching the results with supporters in Ashwaubenon. Local 5's Caitlin Corbett joins us live now with more. Caitlin? Yeah, we're back at the Legacy Hotel in downtown Ashwaubenon. And right now, as you can see, there's still some setup going on right now. We have the Cougars setting up. Those are the entertainment tonight. A local band, and that's all happening here now, ahead of the doors opening at 7 o'clock for Republican businessman Tony Weed. Now, Weed is hoping to win the 8th Congressional District seat tonight, challenging Democrat Dr. Kristen Lyerly. It's the first time in eight years Wisconsin voters will choose a new representative for Congress after Republican Mike Gallagher vacated his seat in April. It's also Weed's first run for office. He formerly owned Dino Stop gas stations in the area before selling them in 2022. I spoke with Weed's campaign manager, Aiden Stronggreen, earlier today. He said that Weed's feeling confident. He also added that Weed feels his status as an outsider to Washington gives him an edge and allows him to bring what he calls a common sense mindset to Capitol Hill. Now, again, things get underway here at the Legacy at 7 o'clock. Those polls close at 8 o'clock. We're going to be here all night giving you live updates as this night continues. For now, in Ashwaubenon, Caitlin Corbett, Local 5 News.